It's been quite a pleasant day as temperatures have gotten up into the 60s and this is going to be the trend for the next couple of days at least. You can see our skycast for tomorrow looking at about 66 for our high, if not warmer. The main driver of this is going to be these winds whipping in from the southwest. We're looking at about consistent 18 to 22 mile per hour winds, but we could see those gusts at about 35 miles per hour. So it is going to be a little bit gusty tomorrow, but again, this is going to be the main driver of this warm air. So I definitely recommend going out and enjoying that. As for Monday, we are looking at possibly even warmer temperatures temperatures in the higher 60s, maybe even the 70s. Um, if we can get that extra warm air, it is going to be pretty sunny on both Sunday and Monday. Uh, so hopefully that'll help us warm up just a bit. Now, here is what we're looking at for the rest of the week. We do have some chances uh, for some rain after this warm weather. Um, unfortunately, this also comes with a cool down, so it is going to be pretty cold and rainy for the majority of the week. So I definitely recommend going out and enjoying this weather while you still can. We see this lower pressure up to the northwest bringing us this kind of warmer air throughout the day, and that is going to be kind of the trend. We do have this weak little cold front that kind of moves th through on Monday, but again, it doesn't really seem to affect us that much as temperatures are still going to be moving up into the upper 60s. Uh, so again, definitely looking forward to that. And then we do start seeing our first chances for rain starting on Tuesday night. And this uh, kind of tracks all the way through Wednesday. We are going to be seeing those chances uh, pretty much spread throughout the entire day Wednesday. And we do have below freezing temperatures to the north of us, which means the north is going to be getting some of that snow. And uh, if those temperatures start to shift towards us, we could see uh, those possibilities of some slight flurries. But as of right now, we are trending in the warmer direction. And then the highest chances to see that widespread precipitation is going to be on Thursday night into Friday. And then Friday through Saturday, we do actually see uh, those chances continue. Now, again, highest chances are going to be on Thursday, but we do still have chances throughout the whole entire week. So definitely recommend bringing that umbrella. So here's those temperatures are as we move throughout the week, we are going to see they really, at least for our area, stay above freezing. Those colder temperatures are going to be staying to, to the north of us as of right now. But you can see it gets pretty close Thursday night into Friday. So that might be the main thing you want to watch as we approach that. So again, high temperatures to start the week really uh, way above average for this time of the year, but then we start moving back down to average by uh, for the majority of the week.